Welcome into sports. I'm Brandon Gardner. Well, the Mandan Braves are off to a strong start this season, currently sitting atop of the WDA standings with 21 points. For the Braves squad, efficient plays on both ends of the pitch have them poised for a run at the state title. KX Sports' Ryan Blank has more. The Mandan Braves are off to one of the best starts in program history, winning seven consecutive games. One key to the Braves' success has been the core of eight seniors. You know, I've spent a lot of a lot of years, probably six, seven years with a senior class um, on the club side as well. So I think it's really helped and they've just really kind of shaped the program in the last three, four years. We've all been playing together for so long and we we know each other on and off the field. We're friends on and off the field. And I think that really helps us out on the field and to play our game. Another reason for the early season success is Sarah Helderop. After a 12 goal campaign as a freshman last season, the sophomore midfielder leads Mandan with 24 points, including 17 goals. Everybody's helped me out on the team to get to that where I need to be. Cause I think like coming in as a freshman, I was a new player, so I didn't really know how to play with these girls. But now, like, building off of that this year, I think we've gotten a lot better together, not just individually. As a sophomore, the way she's playing at the minute is fantastic, and she kind of kind of started last year as obviously as a freshman and was kind of struggling maybe towards the end of the season. But I think she came in this year extra motivated, and I think it's absolutely showing. Despite having to replace all four defensive starters from a year ago, the Braves have been strong on the back end, surrendering only three goals in their first eight games with six shutouts. I have trust in everyone in our back line and our back line is made up of pretty much seniors. We do have a couple um, underclassmen, but best out on the field. We've had like some of our defensive midfielders drop back into defense and I think they're re doing a very good do job transitioning into that position. Like Abby, she's doing great. She was playing center back at one point, outside back. She's getting moved all around. You know, Mila's played everywhere on the field. After falling in penalty kicks in the state tournament last season, Mandan is motivated to take the program where it's never been before, a state championship game. Every year we've been so close and every game has been so close. That's my number one goal for the end of this year and I think that everyone on our team has the same goal so I think we can do it. The fact that we didn't do as good as we definitely wanted to and think we could, like I think that's what's motivating us is we want to do better and we think we can beat the better teams like Minot and those teams out there. Reporting for KX Sports, I'm Ryan Blank.